Uh, okay, hello, hello, hello. I forgot to take the tape off my um webcam. Sorry. Been a couple weeks, but here I am. Ready. Yeah, let's move myself over here. Ready to play some Pokemon Shield. <clears throat> Sorry, still finishing. You would think I'd have this down by now. You would think. But I don't. I am totally not professional, am I? Okay. So, <clears throat> last time, I beat the gym challenge. I beat the Champion Cup. My Pokemon trainer is the league champion. And I did it using a score bunny, a Grookey, and Sabo. Afterwards, I, I let them evolve, so now it's a, a Cinderace, a Rillaboom, and an Atelion. But they're still my team. And they're still with me. And today. <clears throat> We're going to finish the game. So I'm just going to leave this uniform on. I don't, I, I'm not really going to change outfits. I was thinking about it, but... Decided not to. Decided not to. What I'm going to do... Is we're going to finish the post-game. But first, actually, you know what? Now that I have my team, what I'm going to do <clears throat> is give everybody up their new the 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 powers. Yeah, you know what? No, I'm not. I'm not gonna worry about it if I need to. I'll worry about it then. <clears throat> As you can see, though, I did change my team. I'm leaving Kupfu on there. I'm putting my Boltoon back in there and my Lunoon in there. For type coverage. They're not as powerful, but... We'll see how they get. Also, I traded from my Switch Lite. And threw in a Zacian. That way I can have Zacian and Zamazenta. And I should go back to my Dropbox just in case I catch anything. I don't think I will, but you never know. But today we're just going to finish the post game. Run into a Wooloo's butt. And head back into the slumbering wheel. I'm going to walk because I do not like riding if I can't steer. I really don't want to go to low levels. I think this is what I have to do.
But I didn't go after everything last time. Ooh, life orb. Nothing really big, cool thing going on this week. Do I have one, do you think? Do I have a Muna? I think it's cute. Yay! I got my, I got my, I got my Rupio back. Okay. Sorry. Yay, got a Muna! Okay, it's not much. It's, it's just a Muna, but still. It eats dreams and releases mist. The mist is pink when it's eating a good dream, and black when it's eating a nightmare. Don't eat my dreams, Muna. Silly psychic type Pokemon eating dreams. What what color does it um emit when it's um eating um um an adult dream? Yeah, let's use that term. An adult dream. I don't think the game wants to say. Can not go that way? Okay. Do I have one of you? Wheezing. <laughs> That's what I'm like sometimes. I am definitely wheezing. And last week... Last week I was a coughing. Last stream I was a coughing. Really? Uh, it's like I got asthma or something. I keep wheezing. Okay, that was that was bad. Sorry about that. Get everything. Yes, I did. Okay. Just in case. I found a hop. I'm going to go throw a quick ball at him. Sorry. Huh? Caddy. What are you doing here in the woods, you wee tough laddie? 
Yeah, what about you? Why are you in the woods, huh? Gonna cause trouble? You here to cause trouble, Pop? Huh? 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 You here to cause trouble? Get my eye on you, Hop. Get my eye on you. Yeah, nobody ever comes in here. And this is the forest where Sassian and someone's interested, you we taft lade. It's the best place to do a bit of thinking. Since it's so quiet and dull. And a very lovely spot for a picnic. I mean, look at that. You go sit back over there. Sit back there. Very lovely spot. I would love to go sit back there. You say you felt like something was calling you here, Hikari? That's... That's pretty uncanny, we dark laddie. Eh, but I hadn't had the chance to tell you. Congrats on your victory, Kelly. Stealing me victory like that. Honestly, Kelly, never thought you'd manage to beat me, nor my brother, that we daft laddie. The greatest champion gal I ever had in we daft laddie. He was undefeatable until you came around. It, it, it's still actually pretty hard to believe. Aye. Really, you're amazing, Hikari, even though you're a wee daft lady. Okay, I'm done with that. I almost all swallowed my cough drop twice because of this. Don't want to do that anymore. So amazing, maybe, that I don't even realize just how amazing you really are. Is he asking me on a date? Hikaru, do you think... I think he's asking me on a date. The answer is yes, Hop. The answer is yes. I will go on a date with you. Oh. Battle. Foo. Would you be up for one more battle? Yeah, sure. Why not? Be fun. Thanks, Kyra, you wee daft laddie. Then show me the strength that defeated Lee. The greatest wee daft laddie we ever had. I'm ready when you are, so say the word. Eh. I don't always gonna come at with me with first, so there's one thing that I want. Sorry, Bounce. I can't have a Cinderace without said headbutt. This will be a serious battle. You're ready for that, aren't you? Oh, I'm ready. I'm ready whenever you are, Hop. Let's go! Okay, I'm challenged by Hop. Swing out a double. Level 59 double, huh? Sorry, Wulu. I mean, double. I wonder if the, fresh br uh, the, the friendship bracelet stayed on. And that little anime thing they did, which is on YouTube, um, Hopsulu has a friendship bracelet. It's very cute. I'm gonna level up some of my Pokemon here. I'm gonna throw out a fighting type. Let's do a rock smash. Oof. 
It's alright, Cub Fu. Don't die, Cub Fu. Don't die. Cub Fu died. Don't worry, we'll bury you out here, Cub Fu. We'll bury you out here. I want to give Cup Fu the XP though, so I'm just gonna heal Cup Fu. None of these are counting as victories or as um, losses. No more points. I'm done with the point scoring. I could take out Snorlax easy, but I want Cub Fu to get the XP. I also want Balton to get XP. That's okay. I should, I should give better moves. I should do moves. I should train up my Pokemon. I should. Oh, good paralysis. Ha ha. Think I got ya, huh? Next. Dalton, you're up. Let's take out Cinderace. That, that was easy. Oh. I don't have anything with ground, do I? I only sand attack. We're going to send out the Rufio back out. I think it's electric, 
But I'm not positive. What's ground? I don't remember. Why can't I remember what this little thing is? I think it's electric. Ooh, water attack. Yeah, let's set it on fire. Electric. If it was ground or water, it'd be not very effective. Um, well, I'll put Lanoon out for a sec. I think. Sorry, Lanoon. And then I'll camp. I gotta camp too at some point. No, keep all moves. Urgh. I didn't expect there to be such a gap between you and me, mate. You wee daft laddie. So there was, there really what is no way I could ever beat you. I mean, you beat my unbeatable brother. And if it isn't the two of you again. I was wondering what all that noise was about. And look, you damaged the ruins even more. They're even more ruined. And if it isn't Sonya. Hikaru, congratulations on beating Leon. Ah, it was nothing. It was nothing. I'm the best that ever was. Oh, trying to act modest, are you? Go on, you earned the right to be proud. What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be off assisting the professor? Hop, I'm actually working as my grand's assistant. Or not working as my grand's assistant any longer. I quit my job. I'm now a pop star! In fact, I'm the professor. Oh, I thought you were a pop star. It's been a while. You, you are? Crap. Ugh. The professor quality has really gone downhill, hasn't it? And really, I've got the two of you to thank for that. I was just along for the ride on your adventure, but I ended up taking a real interest in the history of the Galar region. And I came to care for Pokemon even more than I have ever before. Now I'm a vegetarian. Oh wait, there's vegetable Pokemon too. Shh. Now I just drink. Now I just breathe. I'm a breatharian. Oh, crap, there's air po gas Pokemon, too. Crap. I'm gonna die because I can't eat, breathe, or drink. Because everything's a Pokemon. Ah, here's the book I wrote. It's a Pokemon. I even signed it with a Pokemon. That makes it a Pokemon. Professor Sonia's published writings, her new discoveries about the Galar region's legends are recorded in this enjoyable read. What well, reviewer wrote that one, huh? I've already got my own copy. Lined up to buy it on the day it came out. Aw, oh, thanks, Hop. That's so sweet. Yeah, I was the only one in line. Oh. Uh, I'll sign your copy for you later, then? 
Anyway, I uh, got my grand's blessing to put out my first book under my own name. Unlike every time I put out books under her name. Some of them are smutty. I think you can expect great things of the lowly Professor Sony in the future, wouldn't you say? Say? Yeah, I expect so. Sonia, Mikaru, The Ruins. Oh, everything around here just amaze me. I've got a lot to live up to here. So, what are you youngins doing here? Uh, 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 we were having a Pokemon battle. Yes, that's what we were doing. We were having a Pokemon battle. Oh, that's it, isn't it? You two are going to go canoodle. You were putting the rusted sword and the rusted shield back in their place. Didn't know you two were so kinky. Just can't keep holding on to them forever, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's what we were doing. We were just about to do that. You forgot entirely, didn't you? What? You think the two of you are besties now with Sasi and, Sam and Damasenta or something? That must be it, Hikaru. Why well, you felt like you were called here. Let's put the sword and shield back and say a proper thanks for all their help. Maybe if we do, we'll get to see Dawsi and Samosenta again someday. Yeah, I'll do that in a bit. Okay. Hmm. Let's start with some dark type. I want dark and electric right now. Dark, electric, and fighting. Do do. Yeah, let's have a ground type move in here. I'm gonna get rid of. I think I'm gonna get rid of Razor Leaf. No. I'm gonna get rid. I can, I'm gonna get rid of Knockoff. Okay. No. Hmm. Ugh. I'm going to get rid of U turn, I think. place that one.
You know what? I think... I'm gonna get rid of Spark. No. No, I don't want to risk that. I'm not seeing I'm not gonna risk that one. Oh. Do, do, do. I'm gonna throw. Doesn't have any dark type moves, huh? I'm gonna get rid of Lear. I got like two more moves I can replace, so. There we go, let's have a good coverage. Okay. I will get you guys some food. Okay, go play then. I'm gonna go make you some food, okay? Okay, let's go with
Hmm. Let's have a couple of P.E.K.K.A. in there. Move our sweet. I'll throw a citrus in there, though. And a little bit of sour. Let's throw two mangoes in there. Let's throw a quallet in there. Okay, there we go. This should go. This should be good. Okay. Michael, go on. Okay, carefully stir. No, be careful not to spill too much. You want to make it mess up your stove. You want to stir it just right. And then throw your heart into it. Literally just rip it right out of your chest and throw it in. Okay. Sorry. Three of them are talking. They're, they're recounting their victory. Now you're wondering why I called you both here today. Tell you on one. Woo. My cup poo.
Got fast in your old age there, didn't you, Dalton? Go play, buddy. Really, I just wanted to heal everybody up. Hmm. Return the rusted shield. Not the rusted sword. Sassy and Zamacenta. Thanks, Lode, for helping us out. Took us a little while, but we've brought back your precious relics and all. <clears throat> you and Hop return the rusted sword and the rusted shield. All right, that about settles it. Caro, why don't you and I head back? Uh, what are you going to do, Sonia? I think I'll stay here a bit longer. I want to do a little more research here in the forest. Hmm, my power spot detector is going off. Well, well, well. I thought I heard somebody making some noise over this way. Well, well, well. You wouldn't be the Professor Sonia who wrote the book Gala, A History. <laughs> uh, yeah? Um, about my book? Why, yes, of course. Read it from cover to cover. Why, yes, of course. Even wrote an internet review for it. Oh, that awful book was filled with lies, so we gave it one star. <laughs> oh, aren't we so funny with all our stupid haircuts and all that? What? There are no lies printed in that book. That's just plain rude. I am Swordward. Handsome Swordward. I am Shieldbutt. Pretty Shieldbutt. We are the new kings of Galar. We are descendants of the first kings. More than that. We're celebrities. New kings? Descendants? Seriously, what are you on about? What exactly are you two supposed to be, huh? They said they're, new, they're celebrities and they're new kings. All hail the kings and their ridiculous hair. Well, well, well. Could these things here be the fabled sword and the fabled shield? Well, well, well. They certainly are dirty. And they must be fake. I fear to touch them with my bare hands. Well, well, well. Swordward took the rusted sword. Well, 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 shield, but took the rusted shield. Well, well. Hey, don't go nicking those. We just returned them. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. Sorry. Oh, do shut up. We only happened to pick up some things that were dropped on the ground. If you've got a problem with it, how about you prove to whom they belong? Hmm? I should stop with the silly voices. But there's no way anyone can prove who those ancient things belong to. Even if we can't prove it, they're really important to Sassin and Samazenta. Oh goodness, such a plebeian and yet so pushy. If it's really so important to you, perhaps we should settle this with a battle, hmm? We're celebrities who buy battles for twice what they're worth. Yeah, exactly. What does that even mean? I, the magnificent and pretty Shilbert, am your opponent. Do, do, do. Mmm, really? 
Uh, keeping me from using uh, my Zen headbutt, huh? Excuse me. I need something to drink. Uh, let's do Zen headbutt again. Good job, Rufio. Off still isn't gone. Just better. Oh, another fighting type, huh? You know what, Dalton, your turn. I could defeat you with one Intellion tied behind my back. <clears throat> okay, let's forget an old move. Let's just do what this Focus Bunch do. Mm. Ah, risky. I don't want to risk it. Clink clang. Hmm. I'm gonna risk it. As a celebrity myself, I mean, I think the champion of Galar would be a celebrity, right? Oh, protect. Good job, Sierra. She's a mighty, she, she's mighty. Bronze song. Kafu, you got this one. Maybe. It might be psychic. No more warm ups. It is time to beat you, Hello. <laughs> well, well, well. Sorry, Cub Fu. Let's swap you out. You'll get some XP for this. Mm. 
Mm. Put all my coins over here. I'm done with the warm-ups, now how about a real fight? Oh, how can this be? My... My Pokémon! Some celebrity. <clears throat> to have... To somehow have been defeat... To somehow defeated the... Adorable Pokemon I go strolling with. You're certainly strong. Well, I am the champion. And I did beat the unbeatable. What did you do recently, huh? Oh, well, try to bully and bully children? Is that what you did? You're not very nice, especially you with a um Um Male body part for hair. Sorry, Carol. Lost to him. <laughs> Something on your mind, boy? You weren't concentrating at all during our battle. <clears throat> Ninga brother, isn't that the one who stopped at Tinnitus? Oh ho, now that I look closely, I believe it is. Well, well, well. What a rude child, snatching about clans at glory like that. According to our sources, I believe he was also present during the destruction of the magnificent mural our ancestors so artfully created many years ago. What a garish brute, destroying the mural our family has held in such high esteem for so long. You mean that child's drawing? I mean, the one that did the historical ruins of Samazenta and the others? Hmm? And hold on a moment, Hikaru wasn't even the one who destroyed it. That was, that was Bead. You want to pick on somebody? Go to the fairy tip and pick on Pete. Why are you picking on him? Why are you picking on me? Why are you picking on me? Why are you picking on me? I'm gonna, I'm gonna come over. I'm gonna come over there. Let us withdraw for now. Next time we shall bring Pokemon that will utterly defeat you. Yes, let's do that. And with that, farewell. Wait, stop, get back the rest of the sword. Hold on, hop! Ugh, that kid, he's gone and recklessly run off. At least you're called Makaru. I expected as much. I'm surprised that Hop lost to someone like that, though. He looked upset about something during the battle. Maybe that had something to do with it. His own rival became the new champion, and his dream vanished before his eyes. You stole that trip. You broke that boy's heart. I'm going to whoop you. You can't help but wonder how it feels about it all. Anyway, Sword Ward and Shieldbert, was it? I think I might know something about where those two weirdos went. Uh, shall we go... <clears throat> shall we go over it at the lab in Whitehurst? I'm worried about Hop. Yeah, I get it. I feel he's, you feel responsible for him and something, something, something because I press buttons. Okay, we'll meet up later then. I'll head back to the lab. I'm just going to go grab my Kleenex and um, I will be right back. Sorry, I'll make sure I have my Kleenex near me so I can um, um, well, use it if I need to. Okay. Actually, before I do that, I'm going to go to bed. It's been a long day. I should get a nap. Da da da. So I'll have to ask mom to help.
Headless the Wooloo. I'm looking for a Pokemon that I <clears throat> didn't already have. Darn. Professor Sonia, you have a visitor. I'm telling. Sorry, I don't know why I use the title. I'm telling voice. Hey, Kairo, glad you're here. <clears throat> so you got an assistant now, huh? Spot on. I've been busy with my research, so I decided to bring on some extra help. I've been keeping all the wishing stars that Chairman Rose had been gathering here in the lab. Things have been a little hectic around here, but my assistant has been handling things in uh, a proper fashion. She's... But really been helping me keep up with things and keeping things afloat and stuff. Yeah. Oh, I haven't been doing all that much. You're Karu, the champion, right? I'm really glad that I get to meet you. It's an honor, truly. Uh, come here for a moment, would you? There's something I want you to have a look at. You remember my power spot detector, right? It detects places where dynamaxing is possible. Basically, when there's a high concentration of Galar particles, uh, the rating spike. And that's how I figured it out. The power spot detector reacted when those two got close. So... Basically, follow the readings from the power spot detector, and it might be able to find those sword and shield weirdos. Squidward, I mean Swordward and Shieldbert might claim to be royalty with their weird fancy names, but it's easier to just call them weirdos, don't you think? Let's get them back on topic, though. I placed power spot detectors all around Galar, and now it's their time to shine. Power spot detectors, unite! Uh, to grass gym. Not in Moto Stoke. Okay. Whoa, -ho -ho! that's a way bigger reaction than I would have thought. Looks like it's coming from Turfield Stadium. I could always Dynamax Pokemon at the stadium, so that's not exactly unusual. But these readings are way higher than normal. It can't be Eternatus. Uh, you've got that in a ball. Maybe it's something related to those Sword and Shield weirdos. Let's go check it out, Hikaru, since you are a snazzy new champion and all. I've set up your town map to show where those strong particle readings are coming from, so have a look at it. Can I go up these stairs? I can. Okay. Well then, time to go to Turfield. I'm gonna go the, the, the long way. I'm gonna take the train. <clears throat> I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna follow my footsteps. 
Except I'm gonna use a bike. <clears throat> I'm gonna go hit. Okay, any super bright, shiny things? I can take on the Sonics. <clears throat> Easy. Oh-ho! Good job, Rufio. Hmm. <clears throat> Let's see if Kapu can survive this. I want to try to catch the Onyx because I don't have one. Whoops. I want to use defense. Now, <clears throat> now to catch it. One, two, three. Got it. No. Oh boy. One, two, three. Oh, thank goodness. I saw another Pokeball on it. Good job, Zira. It rapidly bores through the ground at 50 miles per hour by squirming and twisting its massive rugged body. Nah, let's just send it to a box. Yeah, I don't see any um, special ones. Yeah, I'm connecting to the internet. Seeing if there's any uh, particularly bright ones. That's a camp. 
Hmm. I'm not seeing any particularly bright ones. Hello, Victor. Oh, so Moses is trying to pl plant an illegal garden. Bonjour. I swear, illegal garden. Done by people who don't know how gardens work. I mean, that's gotta be it, right? Okay, I think there's a way down here. <clears throat> Someone will teach a move. Eek Champion! Do you want to teach your Pokemon the marvelous move Steel Beam? Sure, why not? Toby Namaru can use it. I'll give it to Zacian. Powerful, but I don't like it. Okay. <clears throat> I knew somebody down there could uh, teach a move, but. Oh, did I miss one? Okay. I'm just gonna go grab a cough drop. There we go. Mm. Mm. 
Excuse me. Oh, there's a burb. I don't need a burb. Oh, Gossiplur, I have one, I think. Yeah, I do. No, I don't. Surprisingly, I don't. Sorry, Rufio. Good job, Rufio. That's the reason why I'm kind of doing it this way. That's any Pokemon I don't already have. It whirls around in the wind while singing a joyous song. This delightful display has charmed many into raising this Pokemon. Nope. Nope. I don't need a Zigzagoon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This shouldn't take too long. Oh, Champion, I never thought I'd run into you in the mines. I've been doing some voluntary community service on Mr. Rose's behalf. Mr. Rose, a long time ago, he used to work in the coal mine, you know. That's why I'm actually happy doing this kind of work. Yes, I'm so happy. I think I'll give you one of my prized lead cards. No, 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 you don't need to worry. I have hundreds of copies of Mr. Rose's lead card. They're all signed, too. Champion, thank you for stopping Eternatus. I know Mr. Rose feels the same way, but he was just so worried about the future. So worried that I couldn't wait another day. Okay. Head off to the grass gym.
Hmm? You're... Who are you again? Hmm. 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 Oh, hello there, champion. Oh, that's who that is. The champion. Yeah. Now I understand. Yeah. Uh, so you came. Uh, what's going on here? Uh, how carefree can you be? You're the new champion. You're bigger than a Dynamax Pokemon right now. I was actually in the middle of an exhibition match with Piers, and this Dynamax Pokemon came charging on in. The audience and staff already took shelter. I got everyone who was seated on the north side of the stadium evacuated. You must have heard, right? More Dynamax Pokemon are running amok. Much obliged, Top. I'd expect nothing less from a gym challenger. I knew we could count on you. I lost in the semifinals, though. Yeah, and how m How many people didn't make it to the semifinals, huh? 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 How many? How many people didn't make it to the semifinals, huh? Most of them! Ah, Hikaru. I chased those red and blue guys and saw them heading to Surfield Stadium. Then I heard that uproar and there was no way I could leave it alone. I had to help out. So, uh, sorry. I actually lost sight of them in all the rush. Hmm, those suspicious characters you saw are concerning. But for now, I think we should get this Dynamax Pokemon to settle down first. I'd be glad for your help against such a tough-looking opponent, Champion Hikaru. Of course. All right, then. Let's head into the pitch. I'll lend a hand to... I guess. If I must. I don't blame the Pokemon, of course. But I'm a bit miffed that they just upstaged me like that. You come too, bro, the old champion. I don't know how much help I can really... If I come along, I might just end up slowing the rest of you down. Dude. Dude, to get to the semifinals. To get to the semifinals, you completed the gym challenge. That's a lot better than most people. I really don't know about the guy, but I think Leon would be all lost about this. Though he does actually get lost a lot. I'm coming. Okay. Pierce might look scary. Not really. But he's great at looking after others. He is a big brother after all. Alright, where'd you get going to? Great strategy, huh? Uh, I'm gonna use you. Okay, I got Gigantamax you. Before the next fight, I got Gigantamax Rufio. Looks like things have finally calmed down a bit. This time to make stuff. No matter how many times I see it, I still don't like it. I can see your dino dislike of Dynamaxing still hasn't changed, Pierce. But there was definitely something off about that Dynamax transformation. 
There wasn't any trainer anywhere. And the Pokemon seemed like it couldn't even control the power itself. Mm, quite right. Normally, a Pokemon needs to respond to a Dynamax band in order to Dynamax, but... There's so it seems there was some discord in the harmony between trainer and Pokemon. Did you feel anything unusual, Hikaru? Yep. So you noticed something was off, too. There's no trainer to be found. This really is a mystery wrapped in an enigma. Wrapped in bacon. I'll make sure Turfield Jim takes good care of this Pokemon for the time being. And get some bacon. You lot really helped me out there. Thanks for that. Oh, and Hikaru? Uh, if you should ever need my help, feel free to call me anytime. Oh, okay. I'll call you. Especially if I have a tree to lift. All right, then. Follow me, little Sarina. Well, well, well. Looks like that Dynamax nonsense has calmed down. Well, well, well. The champion, as expected. Ah, it's you two. I knew you'd be here. Give the rusted sword back, you wee daft laddie. Well, well, well. I never. It's not like it's something that belongs to you either. Mm. Even if it were yours, we wouldn't give it back. <laughs> well, well, well. What's with these two? Get over here so I can battle ye, you, you wee deaf laddies. Who are these guys? Spectators and staff should have evacuated. The normal rules simply do not apply to us. Yes, that's what it means to be celebrities. Well, well, well. Bare face. Who is this ruffian to question us? Not just someone with strange tastes and hairstyles. His entire style is complete black and white and pink, isn't it, older brother? Uh, you think I'd put any faith in words from rude little punks like you? With her very questionable haircuts. But it seems our experiment was a success, younger brother. Mm, quite, quite. Next time, let us try to dynamax an even stronger Pokemon. Yes, yes. At last, we shall reveal the true nature, nature of Zacian and Samacenta. <clears throat> what was that about Zacian and Samacenta? You despicable champion. We're going to keep letting Dynamax Pokemon run wild. If you want to stop us, do your best to chase after our splendid looking bottoms. This is a children's game, folks. This is a children's game. A children's game. This is a game for children. This is a game for children, and yet I'm playing it. Well, well, well. More like celebrity bottoms. <laughs> <coughs> and with that, farewell. So you were the ones who caused all this. Stop! Calm down, Hop. Don't you don't gotta act so hard. But but they're getting away. Yeah, and they could be leading us into a trap. It's a bad idea to run in unprepared. But still. Ah, fine. You're right. I get it. Good. Let's all calm down for a sec. Thanks to them running their mouths, we know their goal is to force Pokemon to Dynamax. And they can plan to continue doing it. Well, we have to stop them. Yeah, we. There's no time to get hung up on getting back the Rusted Sword. 
Carol Pierce, we've got to stop those two. Yep. Ah, there you are, Hikaru. Things are a right proper mess. Just when I thought the Galar particle count around Turfield had calmed down, I started getting huge Galar particle readings from Hallberry Stadium and Motostoke Stadium. <clears throat> so what exactly happened at Turfield? Well, there was this giant Sarina terrorizing the crowd. So Hop ran in and got got, got people out while Pierce and um, um, Milo you know, cleared everybody else out. And then and then we all went in and we fought the giant Sarina. And um, I need I need to um, I, I I need to be able to gigantamax my Cinderace. So I'm gonna go do that before I go to, go to Hullberry or to, or, or Motostoke. And then then after that, those Sword and Shield weirdos came out and explained their entire plan to us. What a Dynamax Pokemon went on a rampage? Huh. And those Sword and Shield weirdos did it. Oh, Sonia. Hop? Pierce? Weren't you listening to my story? I don't think she was listening to my story. Pierce, what are you doing here? Shouldn't you be back in Spike Moose? I'm an ex-gym leader. I can be whatever I want. It's not that weird. More importantly, you said there were Dynamax Pokemon at other stadiums? Yeah, I'm getting the same rings from other towns as I was in Turfield Stadium. Spike Moose. I'm worried about Marty! Uh, but Spike Moose Gym should be okay, right? I'm only seeing readings from Hullberry Stadium and Motostoke Stadium. Oh, yeah. We don't have Dynamax Pokemon there anyways. So we should be good. If Pokemon are being forced to Dynamax and running wild, there's no way I can simply sit by and watch. What do you say, Hikaru? Let's get to the other stadiums. Yeah, that's a spirit champion. Leave those sword and shield weirdos to me. I can poke around the net for sightings of them. Uh, we'll leave researching to this, uh, Sonia, was it? We should get to the other stadiums and help out. Yep. Totally. That's where I'm going to go next. That's totally where I'm going next. Totally not going to go look for mushrooms. I, yeah, I need nine. I need nine mushrooms. This will destroy the scenery of a sandstorm. Okay. I just want to see if I can find some more max mushrooms. I need like five more. I want to be able to Gigantamax all my Pokemons. Oh, thank you, Bartek. Yeah, pre-cooked burgers. I want a burger. I don't have any buns, though. I want a cheeseburger. I, I want a cheeseburger that I don't make for myself. That's what I want.
So I don't miss any if I see any mushrooms in here. I want to see if I can find any more max mushrooms. Want some more max mushrooms? I just want max mushrooms. Some more max mushrooms. Okay, I'm going to turn the, uh, yeah, I'm going to turn off the internet here. I'm going to turn off the internet. <clears throat> <clears throat> Don't know if this will help me find max mushrooms, but... I just connected from the internet. Okay. Just want to max mushrooms. I'll at least get two of my um, two of my main ones. Uh, all gigantamaxable. Gigantamaxable Pokemons. That's all I want. Just like I'm gonna make my Pokemon Gigantamax. Okay, good. Caught it. Its fangs are highly venomous. If this Pokemon finds prey, it thinks it can eat. And it leaps for them without any thought of how things might turn out. Oh, max mushrooms. Yay, good. That's now five. Four, five, six, 
four more clusters. So six. So three more. Three more clusters of mushrooms. Three more clusters. Three more clusters. And then I can evolve. I'll be able to take Antimax. My Pokemons. Two more clusters. <clears throat> Two more clusters. I can find two more clusters, I hope. There's one up there. Probably already have a toodle. I have. Oh, do I have an Amolka? I should go back and get an Amolka. I should get an Amolka. I want an Amolga. <clears throat> I should need just one more cluster of mixed mushrooms. That thing looks like a Power Rangers monster, doesn't it? Okay, I was just sliding and going by quickly. I was hoping, but nope. Oh ho ho, am I getting all, do I have all the mushrooms I need? Do I have all the mushrooms I need? Yes, I do. Ha ha. All the mushrooms I need.
Let's fly right to the dojo. Yep. Everybody to be able to jump, at least my main three to be able to Gigantamax. Okay. Next. Okay, can I just fly there? No, I can't, okay. <clears throat> now I just want to get, get an Amoga. <clears throat> and then I'm going to go back to the, the, the weirdos. Actually, you know what? I'm going back. I want you on my team. I want you on my team. Really? Okay, you're not on my team. Darn, I wanted that on my team. It's gonna get down my team, but nope. I'm gonna get the Emolga. I know where to get the Emolga. Usually there's an Emolga. This time it's a Pikachu though. Maybe it's the next one. Oh. There we go. There's the Volga. It's adorable. I want one. I want you on my team. Team. I want to see if I can get the Zorura ra, ra, ra too. Zorura. Zorua. Ua. Ua. Zorua. 
，我在这儿玩。哇<音> This Pokemon absolutely, absolutely loves sweet berries. Sometimes it's up its cheeks full of so much food it can't fly properly. Nah, I don't have a name for you yet. At my party. Sorry, Boltoned. I uh, placed it back on back in my bag. I went the wrong way. Whoops. I want to see if I can find another Zorua. That's Zorua, ra 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 ra. Okay, I don't want you that much. I want to see if I, uh, 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 the the Zoru ra 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 will um respawn. Nope. Okay. Okay. Found map. Turfield. We're at the Pokemon Center, and then we'll go off and do that. Good. Rip you out. You're going to be swapped out here. Put you at the back of the team now. And give you... The magnet. I think there's any cool Pokemon over there. I wonder if Leon ever had to ride his bike. I should ride my bike. I should ride my bike while the weather was so nice. It's been warming up. It's been warming up here, but... I mean, it's like just beginning to warm up like these last couple days, and... 
Hope it doesn't freeze again. Don't get too close, you lot. Things are pretty dangerous here. Yeah, we know the situation. Are the staff and spectators all right? Yeah, they took shelter just a short while ago. You know, the more I look at you three, the more I see how odd a little group you are. Yeah, I mean... Look at the fashion sense of that one over there. With his tiny little backpack and everything. Just odd. We came here to help you out. And I'm grateful for that. That Dynamax Pokemon's power is too intense. I'm sure it'd give me trouble. I'd feel a lot more confident about it if you all joined the battle. Let's do it. Okay. A Gyarados. It's weird seeing the stadium empty. G Max Drum Solo. Wow. Been a while since I've touched that again to make the real boom. Okay, good job, Cinderace. Now I just gotta wait for all these animations. Another. Drum Solo, coming right up. And now it's just a normal sized giant serp uh, sea serpent. Nothing to worry about. Because everyone's helped, no one was hurt, and we were able to turn the tide of the situation. I'll keep that Pokemon at Hullberry until I can fully recover. Caro, if you ever need my help, uh, just uh, let me know. And I got her we're Air League card. I suppose I'll see you later. Thanks so much for your help. Truly. Now back to Motostoke. Gotta go the right way. Which is running into a lamppost. It's obviously the correct way to get to Motostoke. Okay, I'm gonna walk through here. Whoops. Come on, Zero, we got this.
So I should uh, swap out Pokemon here, but I'll do it after I get out of the mine. <clears throat> Another move. These things, I hate these things. I hate Dunfisks. I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna run from it. Okay, almost a motor stoke. Okay, just put Sierra at the bottom. Now it's time for Dalton to shine. There we go. Champion Hikaru and Pearson Hop too. Mr. Kabu, I'm glad you remembered me. Of course I do. Uh, you were too, you two were red hot after all. Never forget seeing you two off after you completed your first leg of the gym challenge. I don't think we got time for a friendly chin wag. Right. Actually, the switch duration is getting pretty bad over at the stadium. Yeah, that's why we're here. Murder out here caused more trouble. Ah, brilliant. The opponent's a bit too much to take on single-handedly, so I was wondering what to do. But with all of you at my side, my confidence in this battle is burning brighter than by the minute. Let's begin. Okay. Torkoal. After this fight, I'm going to take a break. Hmm. G Max Hydra Snipe. Let's do that. Let's put this, uh. Turn this, uh, Lava Turtle into a rock? I guess? Maybe? Oops, I forgot I get screenshot of that. I don't think a power ball is going to do too much.
Okay, there we go. Looks like we were able to extinguish things this time. I'll let this Pokemon rest here at Motostoke while uh, I get its energy back. And Garo, should you ever have need of my help, please do not hesitate to ask. <sighs> Don't worry, I know. You all have more work that needs to be done, yes? Go forward, youths. I wish you well. Beep, beep. Um, is that your phone ringing? Caro, we get trouble. Those two weirdos have showed up at the Pokemon lab. <gasps> Sonia, are you alright? They keep rudely demanding a hand over wishing stars. I'm alright for now. But get over here quick, okay? These guys are right creepy. What are those two going after wishing stars for? We gotta help get Sonia. <laughs> get back the rusted sword. Let's hurry to the Pokemon lab. He really doesn't think anything through, does he? Ah, sure does make him seem a proper fool. Eh, I guess a word would be reckless instead. Ah, uh, we're headed to the Pokemon lab next, right? Guess I'll stick by you till we see this through. Okay. And this is where I am going to take an official break. To get up, stretch, move around, and um, get something to drink. So, I'll be back in a bit. See you on the flip side. There you go. Now I'm back. Now it's time to head back to the Pokemon lab. Sorry, I want to get, like I said, I want to get up and stretch a bit. You do that every so often. I figure a couple hours. Get up, move around a bit. I don't like to get the tape off my cam again. Tape off my webcam. There we go. Now I can move. Hmm. <clears throat> Oops, why'd I do that? Guess I must not all be that be all there. I mean, I could take a flying taxi, but... Where's the fun in that? <clears throat> so... Back to here. We... We know all the wishing stars Chairman Rose had gathered are here. We celebrities have an enhanced level of insight into such things. You non-celebrities are not suited to having such valuable things. Hand them over to us! Wishing stars and being a celebrity have nothing to do with each other. Which is true. I don't know how you knew about this, but there's no way we're giving them to you. That's right. You could never understand how important these witching stars are. You have no need for them. Goodness, whatever, goodness, whatever shall we do, younger brother? It would certainly seem we have been inconvenienced, to older brother. <laughs> so and the professor are the ones who have been inconvenienced here. Hop! Forcing Pokemon to Dynamax against their will. <clears throat> You've gone way out of bounds here. And I haven't forgotten about getting the rusted sword back either. Well, well, well. I certainly thought the champion would come, but I didn't think a loser would follow. Mm, 
Well, well, well. Must I... Must I have you once again taste the flavor of a humiliating defeat? Ugh. Don't let those goons put you down. That's right. You lost a battle, but don't lose that rocking spirit. R right. See, see, how is he not a celebrity? How is Pierce not a celebrity? Literally, people are like, Oh my god, Pierce is doing a free concert! It's weird. Um, my phone's going off like mad right now. Wow! I, th I, shouldn't, I should silence my phone as well. Okay. Okay, it's just notification, no, normal notifications. I gotta really turn off the vibrate from threads. All right. Let's fight them together. Thanks, mate. First things first, let's get these weirdos out of here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Weirdos? Oh, how they wound me, older brother. To be called such a terrible thing as weirdos by these ruffians. Indeed, to address royals such as ourselves in such a manner cannot, will not be forgiven. This time I bought much stronger Pokemon to thoroughly trounce you with. Really? Really? You got those stronger Pokemon, huh? Yeah, that was easy. Good job there, double. Can't even use one Pokemon, can ya? <clears throat> Good job, Dalton. I'm doing something that's not going to kill you. Never mind. <clears throat> oh, boy. Do, do, do. A little caffeine, a little five hour energy, give you the shakes. This is me on five hour energy.
Oh, did he? Just kick it once. I don't like double edge. I do not like any move that injures my Pokemon too. This isn't gonna be hard. There goes the double. <clears throat> That's why you don't use double edge. Good job, Rufio. Bam! Fireball to the face. <clears throat> Fireball to the face. <laughs> Quite the fixing predicament indeed, older brother. Surely this must be some kind of mistake, wouldn't you say, younger brother? <clears throat> I did it. We won. We really won. Yeah, that's easy. You got me on, the on your side. My ex the exquisite Pokemon we trained actually lost. <clears throat> How rumph. You only won because you two teamed up. Still, we offer you ruffians our praise. Oi. Do it. You teamed up too. Now give back the rusted sword and stop forcing Pokemon to all go all crazy. Uh, is this a bad time? My apologies for the intrusion. Uh, these men are dangerous. Be careful. Well done. Your infiltration mission was a resounding success, it seems. <clears throat> Have you gathered the wishing stars? Yes, thanks to Master Swordward and Shieldbert for buying me so much time. Da 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 da. What? Stop! Give back those wishing stars! Oh dear. Seems we've been completely had. <laughs> my, this moment is so sweet, I don't think I'll need any sugar in my tea later. I'll battle with you is just a little trick. We'd won before you grabbed a single Pokeball. Why do they look like game show hosts? They're game show hosts! That's how celebrity... We got a rock star over there. Got the Galar champion over here. You two aren't celebrities. You're game show hosts. And with that, farewell. Ta-ta. Tee-hee. Well, well, well. Stop. Why? <clears throat> Professor Sonia, I'm sorry. Was everything... Was it all a lie? Right from the start? There was no helping it. It was necessary for the plan. Our plan to put Galar under the control of the royal lineage once again.
Well, she's not going to talk, so. Wait. Don't just leave without saying anything. Well, last time I tried and she sword, you didn't say anything until I came out. So I just came out because I did not want to deal with that anymore. But you were upset. We didn't want to say anything to make it worse. <clears throat> we were trying to be considerate, but... Of course it'd be down on myself. It was my fault. I got tricked by a nicket in Wooloo's clothing. But that's it. No more feeling sorry for myself. That lot made off like bandits with all the wishing stars. It'd be awful if they used it for some evil purpose, like giving them to Zazian. So there's no time to be feeling down. Oh. <laughs> oh, you got some guts. You've certainly grown strong in the face of adversary, mate of oh, dearie. Gran. Dynamaxing throws out the true strength from trust between a Pokemon and the trainer. But that group is likely pouring the Galar particles emitted by the wishing stores into Pokemon, forcing them to Dynamax. Well, I explained the theft. As expected of the champion, your intuition is quite sharp, Karu. The theft of the wishing stars was just a start. Things could get a lot worse from here on. But why? What reason could they have to be forcing di Pokemon to Dynamax? Those weirdos said that they wanted to reveal the true natures of Sassian and Zamazenta. That's why they're going to pour all the wishing store energy into Sassian to make him go crazy and nuts and kill everybody. Yeah! <laughs> Yes, I'm evil. <clears throat> I'm curious about what my former assistant said about the royal lineage. Did she mean that literally? Hikaru, look at your town map. I'm detecting huge reactions at four stadiums now. They certainly get around, don't they? If there's troubles at the stadiums, then Marnie could be in a real bad way. Uh, Spike Moose seems to be okay. There's no power spot stadium there. Uh, right -o. Hey, Carl, there's no time to be lying about. Pokemon in trouble. Why are we still here? Let's get right out there and lend a hand. I'll leave it to all of you. But you'll have to take care of the Dynamax Pokemon. I'll search for those Sword and Shield weirdos in the meantime. Okay. And back out there. I want to go back to the wild area station. Okay, come on. I'm going to leave the internet off for now. Okay, so we're going to go in stadium order, I think. Same as the gym challenge. It would take less time for me to do it the right way, but, you know, just uh, fast travel, but. I, I want to have some, I, I want to do it this way. <clears throat> Anyways, I really can't see past the uh, bridge field, so. I don't know if there's any super powerful Dynamax uh, or Max stands over there. Okay. Get my team to put back together.
Hopefully, once I get out of here. Oh, come on! I don't not want a zigzagoon. I want to get out of the sandstorm. And see where I'm going. Ah, cute little bug. Do I have a dwebble? No, I do not. It's a cute little bug. There we go. First tries to find a rock to live in, but if there are no suitable rocks to be found, <clears throat> Webel may move into the ports of a Hippodon. Hippodon. Hmm. <clears throat> Central box. I'd like to see that. How am I going up? Hard to tell. Now it's foggy. I think I'm going the right way there. Oh, that, oh. I, I want to get a Havaluka. <clears throat> I have to get a Havaluka. I have to, it's law. But there's a law in the books that says you have to catch a Hauluka. I don't make the laws. I just follow the laws. It always strikes the pose before going with its finishing move. Sometimes opponents take advantage of that time to counterattack. Set it to a box. Okay, up into Hammerlock. <clears throat> there we go. And just run through the desert. Oh, it's just a Doug Trio. Okay, just send hit button. I 
I really don't want any mask. No offense to your mask. But you're, you're not Jim Carrey, you mask. <clears throat> Now, one of these days, I will watch that movie again. I mean, it's been over 20 years since I've seen that movie. It's been nearly 30 years since I've seen that. It's been over 30 years. No. No, it's been almost 30 years since I've seen that movie. When that movie first came out on, um... On VHS back in the day. I watched it like every night for like two weeks. I haven't watched it since. I really should watch it. <clears throat> I have a theory about that movie, though. I think um, if we didn't have that movie, we wouldn't have Jim Carrey, the serious actor. Because Stanley Ipkiss uh, was just a normal guy that Jim Carrey had to play in the movie, where he wasn't really mugging for the camera or being his, you know, plastic self. And it proved to people that, you know, he could actually do that, you know, be, you know, somewhat serious. So we wouldn't have, like, serious Jim Carrey and the Truman Show and stuff. We would have, like, you know, he would have just been, like, a 90s movie actor. Oh, you. You came to help me? Uh, something like that. How are things looking? The people all got out. But I'm the gym leader. I'll battle the Dynamax Pokemon. Nice one. Let's, let's all work together. That, that'd be brilliant. Thanks. I like him. There are loads of them. I hope everyone can take one each. Please. Let's go. I like him. He's cute. I want him on Halloween. I want, I want, I want him to come trick-or-treating at my place. Yeah, but it's It'd be creepy. Okay. He has nothing that would be very effective. So let's do a G Max Fireball. gonna hurt. Okay, it didn't hurt as much as I thought it would. <coughs> I think I got something irritating in the back of my throat. Let's just do a max mind storm. It should take it out quickly. The battlefield's about to get weird. The battlefield's weird. Th th thanks a lot. The Pokemon have all calmed down. 
they can rest here. They should be fine in time. Garu. Here. My lead card. I wonder what he sounded like in um, the anime. If they did him and used him in the anime. You you can leave things here to me. I I'd, I'd rather you go help those who need you. Cause you know he's gonna have like a slight whispery voice. So the reason those red and blue buffoons could make so many Pokemon Dynamax was because they hoarded up so many wishing stars. I think they'll probably get even tougher from here. We've still got three more stadiums where there's some Dynamax Pokemon running wild. Let's up the tempo. Next. Next we go after Bead. Get the team ready for this one. Sorry, I'm putting you two up front. Actually, you know what? Put me two in the back. Ready to take on bead. Okay, I don't have any poison or steel type moves. But I I got I got moves. I can handle him. I can handle him. With one bead behind my back. <laughs> you lot. <clears throat> bead, what about the Dynamax Pokemon? You think I, the elite fairy type gym leader, would have any kind of trouble? Ugh, that's right, you're a gym leader now. Though I don't know about elite or whatever. Please, don't tell me you came here to help. First of all, you're a bit late to be of any use. And second, I didn't need any help. Hmm. <clears throat> Why'd I know you'd say something like that? I came all this way out here just to lend a hand. What an obnoxious gym leader. The next gym challenge is shaping up, shaping up to be really something. Well, Leanna tricked me and used me. From now on, only I decide how do I live. And I think what I should do now is have a battle with you, Hikaru. Uh, I'm sorry, mate, but this is hardly the time. Don't always be set in such a hurry, boy. You ace my quiz, so show a little composure. Beat has already quieted three Dynamax Pokemon. He's giving you the luxury of some extra time. Beat's life won't be bound by what other people say any longer. Though I certainly influenced a few of his decisions not too long ago. Uh, now that you mention it, I suppose you did. <clears throat> Yeah, yeah, as I expected of a wise 88-year-old granny, I guess. But this has nothing to do with Miss Opal. This battle's for me. Now, don't dilly-dally. Your only option is to accept. Let's go! My Pokemon and I have risen from the ashes. I'll grant you a brief glimpse at how amazing we've become. Okay. We're gonna do it when we get down to like the last. I'm gonna. Oh, I'm gonna check. My days as a gym leader have made me stronger than you. I'm like um. 
28 levels ahead of you, dude. Okay, first things first. Not very effective, okay? Let's just, uh... <clears throat> melt them all, my, melt them all while. <laughs> Good job there, Rufio. Keep current Pokemon. Hmm. Okay, I think that'll be super effective. The day the fairy type gym leader can beat the you know champion. Rapid dash, huh? Okay, nobody who's that super effective. Well, something me too. Let's freeze the rapid dash. Ooh, full restore. That's why I keep a Mewtwo 2 with me. You might be the strongest champion in Galarian history. Still got a ways to go. I'll make sure to draw out every last bit of strength from you in something, something, something. Hmm. <clears throat> Try another blizzard. Okay, so dodging the blizzard. Ugh. Well, let's just do a psychic. That's fine. We'll let Dalton have this one. Okay. Good job, Dalton. There we go. Took them out. <clears throat> mm. 
there's supposed to be some mistake. I mean, I'm the one who's the gym leader, and I'm the one who's champion. Champion. I defeated the undefeated. Thank you for the battle. I can now accept you as the champion. It's painful to admit, but I've come to realize a few of my weaknesses. But I'll keep getting stronger. I'll reach the pinnacle of what fairy types can do. <clears throat> now then, as gym leader, I will do my duty and clean the stadium. Now that's what I call a perfectly pink Pokemon battle. Even after losing his right to participate in the gym challenge, Beat still found his own way to crash the Champion Cup. <clears throat> yeah, I'd say he's a force to be reckoned with. I think I get why he was chosen to be the next gym leader. He might be unbearable at times, or really, most all the time. But he's a fierce trainer. Yeah, watching him battle you, it was plain to see how much work he puts into it. If you two are both are going to keep jabbing, uh, how about I fit you a nice cuppa? Right, right, I hear ya. But I won't be undone by that beat or anyone. On to the next one. Karu, we still got to help all the other places where the Ustead and Max Pokemon are running wild. Looks like there's still two Pokemon stadiums left to check. Yep, and we're heading to both of them. Okay. Don't need you two anymore. But I will hit the Pokemon Center. And heal up. Now we can recover all my moves. Okay, almost done. Now just run. <clears throat> oh, it's punchy season right now. Okay. I don't know what I was talking about. Oh yeah, Jim Carrey. I just don't think without the mask he wouldn't have been taken as a serious ass actor. Could it actually prove that he could be, you know. Not a plastic person. It's Stanley. So I think that really helped out his career. Did I create more miraculous? Oh, I forgot something. <clears throat> I'm gonna travel back. I'm gonna. I'm gonna just gonna fast travel back to um, Hammerlock too. There's something I was gonna do while I was here. Uh, do I have a ball mushroom? Huh? 
Nope. Go to that Pokemon Center. <clears throat> and from there, we'll travel. Still going to do it this way, though. Or do I have one of you? No, I do not. Oh, come on. Come on. Uh, uh oh. For some reason, if I bump my desk, it, it messes up my capture card. Okay, do I have a Golette? Probably do, I would imagine. Yes, I do. Okay, almost there. Sorry, I'm not really talking to it right now. <clears throat> That's really don't have too much to say, I guess. <clears throat> At least not today. Plus, I'm running low on energy. This time of year is really tough. Get to safety, you three! Who do you think you're talking to, then? We're here to help, not be helped. Oh, it's you three. I was a little too into things, and I didn't notice right away, I'm afraid. Caro's here, so everyone can relax. There are repeatedly no less than four Dynamax Pokemon. I was just going over a plan on how to handle things. With all these strong trainers together, I'm sure we can work something out. Are you ready then? Let's head to the... Well, why don't you use your, you know, your, your, your gym trainers? I mean, get gym trainers. Probably got enough. You can throw like two. Two trainers on each. I mean, that would work. Oh, 
Oh, G Max Fireball to solve the problem here. Then we take on the Dragon type. Okay, let's take this out. Well, bam! Right in the face. I was just getting tired of doing the only starter. That's why I let everybody evolve. Plus, my goal was just to beat, you know, the Leon and become champion that way. Phew. Is everyone feeling all right? Just barely. Battling a Dynamax Pokemon on all, all on your own is pretty hard work. Of course, you had no problem, Makaro. You really seem like a reliable trainer, too, Hop. I do? And it looks like he ain't used to getting compliments. Look, he's got a grin rider than a Meowth. I do not. Shut your gob, Pierce. I'll take care of the Pokemon we battled. No need for anyone to worry. Hikaru, it's not much of a reward, but have a copy of my league card. Give me a call if anything happens. Don't overdo it out there. One more to go to. Looks like most of the stadiums have got this Dynamax problem sorted now. Let's keep up the pace, Hikaru. There's only one stadium with Dynamax trouble left. Let's finish this already. I know I don't have to go to Spike Moose, but... I kind of want to go to Spike Moose. I already have one of you. I don't want one of you. I don't. I don't. I. I, I do not want. I, I do not want a hand tie. I mean, grab block. I've got tentacles. I mean, come on. Okay, oops. Do I have a Marini? I don't think I have Marini. No, I do not have Marini. And I caught it. You can tell by that sound. Okay, we're going to finish this up today. Unlike their lowland counterparts, the Marini of the Galar region have not yet figured out that the branches, of course, of course, Ola are delicious. Ugh. Into a box. And off to Hammerlock. If I have time after this. You know, I think I'm gonna, if I have time after this, I'm going to make a meatloaf for dinner. I had a meatloaf in a bit. I don't have potatoes to go with it, though. 
I think I have gravy. I mean, I got instant mashed potatoes, but I just did instant mashed potatoes last night. Nice timing, you lot. Stadium's just about reached its limit. There's simply too many Dynamax Pokemon running wild in there. Seems Wishing Star Power is being used for some evil purpose. Ah, so that's what's caused this. That's a problem, all right. Before we get that sorted, we gotta do something about these Dynamax Pokemon. Glad we got all of you here now, though we've already done the bulk of the work. We're here to help too, right, Hikaru? We got this. Fantastic. Looks like we got ourselves together an unbeatable team. Especially you, Pierce. The way you battled me in the Champion Cup, you really hit my Dynamax Pokemon up against the wall. Uh, things might actually go better this time if we split up our little band. Right. Everyone split up so we can take down one of the po Dynamax Pokemon. Let's do it. Okay. Oh, crap. I didn't switch out. Do I have time to switch out? I was going to switch out. I can't switch out. Can I switch out? I want to switch out. Good. Dalton. I'll see if I can Dynamax or Gigantamax. Good, I can. We got this now. See, I can do stuff. I can have super effective moves. I do want to do another G-Max hate and snipe. And there we go. Now time to face the end. You guys are the greatest. You really got me out of a tough spot here. I think I better snap a quick one just to remember this victory. Bye. I'll take care of that Pokemon that went wild. No need for all of you to worry about that. Hikaru, give me a ring of things to go pot to pot again. And I got another rare lead card. Probably with phone numbers on them. I think they all want to date me. I'm always happy to lend a hand if I can. The great hair, Rayhan is here for you anytime. And Pierce, you and I got a battle again. This time, no Dynamaxing for either of us. Wishing Star is being used for evil. I assume you are already looking into who's behind it, right? Carry on then. I'll take care of things here at the Hammerlock Stadium. Right, I think that's all the stadium sorted out. We didn't miss any, did we, Hikaru? All that's left to do is catch those sword and, si sword and shield weirdos. If we don't find them quick, they could just start all this up again. Wasn't Professor Sonia supposed to be looking into where those two might be? Yeah, we saw her on the way in. 
She's right over by the elevator doors. And once we find them again, I'm going to take them right down. That's your Rotom phone, Hikaru. It's got to be Sonia. Hikaru, it's me, Sonia, from down the hall. It called it. Those sword and shield weirdos got into Hammerlock Stadium and are headed for the energy plant. The doors of the plant's locked, but I think I can get it open. Give me a bit and you'll be able to get in there. I'm right down the hall. You hear that? Hammerlock Stadium. Get over here as soon as you can. Oh, wait. You're right down the hall. Even over the phone, Sonia sure sounds lively. Well, we're already at Hammerlock Stadium. Uh, the door to the energy plant should uh, be right down the hall. Guess we should get going. What? Huh? You're back already? Hold on a moment. I think I've almost got it. Oh, huh, that's strange. What? It opened? See, we know who the smart one is. Yamper. Yamper, I should have known. Thanks for your help. Those two weird guys are probably up ahead. Be careful. I'm just going to check my... Everybody looks fine. I'm going to save. Well, well, well. It seems you have broken the lock and rescued the stadiums from their perils. As expected of the champion. You follow us, give them your praise. Oh, what's with these weirdos? They really creep me out. Why are you forcing Pokemon to Dynamax? All lies and fake stories, you believe. We did it in order to expose the true nature of Zossian and Summer Center. Mmm. <coughs> Need drink. Enjoy the clapping while I drink. Okay. Zassian and Samba Santa saved all of Galar. <laughs> what a fool! We have always been revered as the resplendent descendants of the real hero. And it's all because you ruffians had to go and save Galar from Eternatus, and that woman went and wrote a whole book about it all. You should be ashamed. You said that the real heroes were Pokemon. You just carelessly changed history. What does that mean we are? I dare say that our esteemed ancestors were all liars. Well, I could believe that you are the descendants of a Galarian king. That's right. Compare the way things were to the way things are now. It's obvious that the old history was better. It was right. Suddenly create heroes left and right. That's complete rubbish. You're wrong. What I wrote was the truth. My hypothesis was that Zacian and Zamazenta have been protecting Galar region since ancient times. Well then, if we are at an impasse, perhaps we should test which truth is the most truthy. If things are really as you say, then even if we bombard them with Galar particles, they should remain calm and stalwart. I get it. So all those sudden Dynamax Pokemon from before were just your little experiments. Are you serious? I want to make the two Pokemon that saved us run all a muck, you wee deaf laddie? <laughs> it seems you are indeed capable of understanding something. My magnificent older brother is wrapping up the preparations above. Aren't he has a magnificent bottom? 
a celebrity bottom. You think we'll let you get away with this? Oh, so you want to take the lift up? Then you'll have to defeat us. Okay. I think be good. This time I shall show you the opulent Pokemon I have raised despicably for this battle. It's explicitly. It's, my brain does not want to work anymore. It is broken. I cannot pronounce things. Okay, we got this. See, I got this. Good job, Rufio. Okay. I'm just going to keep current Pokemon. I'm just defeating the Pokemon by looking at them. And Bon Song. I know you're in a hurry to lose, but we should enjoy this a while longer. I haven't even switched Pokemon yet. How am I gonna lose? I'm just going to ring your bell. Yeah, you lost. Get used to it, man. Oh, oh my noble Pokemon. It's a game show host. That's why you got the lavalier on. And so I am defeated. We've driven them back. Now we can head up to the roof. What was that sound? Ah, uh, well, it appears that my older brother was given enough time. Shall we head up? Let's head up. Do I have any ethers? Probably not. Nope. But I have an elixir. And he's not that far, so it's just a super potion should work. Okay, time for the final. Okay, so. I am going to get up. Take a brief break. Um, go do some things. So, I'll be back in a bit. We're going to take, like I said, just another brief break. And then we're going to finish Pokemon Shield. So, see you on the flip side. Okay, there we go. 
Sorry, just had to go use the little alien's room. Whoa, I did it, I did it, younger brother. It looks like it came following after the rusted sword. I bombarded it with gala particles. Stop, Cersei, it's in pain. It's all because I let them get away with the stealing the rusted sword. Yes, expose your true barbaric, brutish nature. And reveal to us exactly who the false kings are. Oh, the brother! Don't attack me! Go into town and sow as much destruction as you can! <clears throat> He's trying to suppress and calm himself, but I can't control all the power. Sassian. I was hoping we could calm it down like we did the others, but our opponent is legendary. If you're thinking about catching it, think again. I need to admit it. But if anyone can stop it, it's gotta be you, Hikaru. I'll keep everyone else down, safe down here. So you don't have to worry about a thing. You just focus on calming down Zacian. It's coming, Hikaru! Okay, we got this. Okay, do I have any? Pokemon with super effective moves, first off. Okay, I don't. That's good. Okay, let's... Uh, do a fire pledge here. Let's see if it's... Let's hope it doesn't take it out. Okay, let's fireball this thing. Actually, yeah, let's fireball pyro ball this thing. <clears throat> Good job, Rufio. Got this. Sassy, are you alright? <clears throat> Hop, watch out. Samazenta? <coughs> Thanks for saving me, Zamazenta. Looks like it still can't control that power. I don't like this, Hikaru. Not one pit. I'm going after Zacian. And we'll kick you in the balls. This belongs to Zacian, not you. I hope you learned your lesson. Please don't hurt my older brother! As expected of the champion, <clears throat> you took complete control of the situation. Plus, it looks like that Pokemon is waiting for you. Okay, it looks like everybody's healed. Uh, 
I'm going to try a quick ball. Yep, ready the rest of the shield. Okay, we got this, we got this, we got this. Sama Senta has an intense look in its eyes. If it, okay, if that worked, I would have been surprised. <clears throat> I didn't think it would work, though. I really didn't. Okay, everything is super effective, huh? Well, I just want to catch this. Okay. I got two. And since I'm not, probably not going to be playing too much after this, I can use one. Without attacking. <clears throat> this Pokemon slept for eons while in the form of a statue. It was asleep for so long people forgot that it ever existed. Nope. Send to a box for now. Send to the Pokemon as is. Wow, brilliant! Seems like you've been recognized by real royalty. <clears throat> uh, what a sublime battle. We were so preoccupied with fussing over who the new king was. How terribly uncouth like. <clears throat> hey, you spiky head. Oh, what should I go expecting these two to start learning some manners now? My younger brother and I will atone for our crimes. Please escort us to the appropriate place. If you really want to atone, what's with that posh superior attitude, my man? Ah, whatever. Taru, I think I understand why you became the champion. But please don't go calling on me anymore. Seems like I'm only getting called out when you're in some sticky situation. The only one without a phone number on it. Professor Sonia, I can't ask for you to forgive me, but I am truly sorry for deceiving you. I was really hurt at first, but I've rallied. Thanks to you, I've ended up learning quite a bit. Well, that came off a little bit more sarcastic than I thought it would. Uh, well, please continue to do your work as a professor. I don't know why I was starting to give them the, the, the sword, sword Bert and Shield Bert thing. Sword Word, handsome Sword Word, and pretty Shield Bert. Right oh, we stopped them from causing any more harm. Still, I hope Zacian is okay. Hikaru, you're Otam Foam. Probably Hop, I reckon. Oh, Hikaru is just... Whoa, hey, calm down! I suppose you heard that. Yeah, I've got Zacian here with me. Zacian started going crazy, so things have been better. But I'm hanging in there. I could use your help, though. Get over here as quick as you can, would you? I'll be waiting for you in the heart of the slumbering wield. Uh, it sure sounds like he's got his hands full. I guess some things never change. Even if it's Pokeball, Samazenta seems worried about its partner. We should go to the slumbering wield and see how Hop and Zacian are doing. Oh, I can't just... Oh... I am not running back home, though. Let's just go straight to Postwick. And then... We'll be done.
Yes, let's just go right there. Okay, let's put the team together. Sorry, Kapu, you're coming out. Mulga, you're coming out too. And you too, Lanoon. Sassian? Samazenta? <clears throat> and a turn to this. Six legendary Pokemon. There, there, everything's all right. You don't have to lose control. You can manage this. I know you can. You're the true hero, hero who protected Gal the Galar region, after all. Oh, get everything under control? See, I knew you could do it, champ. Hop, you look like fright. But you made it. And yeah, well, I was just focused on trying to calm down Zacian, so... Rushing in and trying to calm down a legendary po hero head-on was awful reckless. You think? Pretty tough to hear that from all of you people, you wee daft laddie. <clears throat> Wait, what? Huh? Really? Are you sure about this? What does Ossian say? That it thinks I'm worthy of it. That it'll become my Pokemon. Pretty sure that was it anyway. What? Seriously? You don't understand that? That's totally crazy! Is it... Is it really okay? Alright then, here I go. Hop cut Sassian. Okay, good. He used a regular Poke below. I had to use a Master Ball. Some people get all this scripted luck. You two are really something. I still don't see anything like that in myself yet. But thanks to your help, I'm starting to. Hikaru, I got a favor to ask. Though I hate to look like I'm copying that posh jerk bead. Still, I want another battle with you, you wee deaf laddie. Everything started right here. In the slumbering wield. Okay, let's do it. This will be a proper battle, Akaru. You sure you're ready for me? Well, I am. Then let's go. Okay, we got this. Double. Let's do it, Hikaru. Don't hold anything back. Okay, then. The smell of burning wool. That's what that smell is. <clears throat> you know, I'm going to go with Zacian. My goal was always to surprise Lee, but he's not champ anymore. 
I'm not sure what my goal is now. Cinderace. Okay. You and certain followed your own path. I was the only one left behind it. Blah, blah, blah. See, we can do this. Good job, Dalton. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Anybody with a ground type move? Then I went around saving Pokemon alongside you and Pierce, and I realized that I could help other people. Good job, Zira. Okay, almost. Corviknight. Let's use Eternatus. Eternatus is friend-shaped. Blast, you really got me with that one, but battling you sure is fun, Hikaru. Okay, we got this. Let's do a Dynamax cannon. Oh, come on. Flamethrower. And aha, you're burned. <clears throat> Burning metal feathers. Ha ha! Burn your metal feathers! Huh? 
I want to see which one of us comes out the victor. But something, something. It's kind of a strange feeling I'm having, Hikaru. Or, that's kind of, the, the kind of strange feeling I'm having. You feel it too, don't you, Hikaru? I knew you must. It's kind of embarrassing, but I'm glad it's not just me. Right then, laugh or cry all you want, but this is it. Something, something. Okay. We got this. See, I got full resource too, Hop. You don't have any. And I still got a team of Pokemon. Darn. Okay. That seems always better than Samazenta. thing is I have Zacian I can always have Zacian fight Zacian. Thanks to you and Lee, I'll keep on getting stronger. I know it. That's our greatest champion for you. You really are strong, Hikaru. But getting beat this time felt a bit different. I may have lost, but I feel great. You know what, Hikaru? I think I found a dream of my own. I want to be someone who can help out Pokemon with that, they're, that are in trouble. Wherever they are. I'm going to be a Nurse Jenny. I mean, I think I want to become a prof Pokemon professor. I started thinking I might when we were going around to all the stadiums to help the Pokemon that were running out of control. <clears throat> I know I don't know enough about Pokemon yet. And I've got no experience for this sort of thing. But I'm going to study and learn a whole lot. And someday, I'll become the sort of professor that you, Hikaru, and you, Sonia. Well, the sort you'll, you'd be proud to know. I'm going to take a different path than you and Lee are taking, Hikaru, but... I'll still always think of you as my true rival. I still don't plan on losing to you, though. Not like I ever plan on you losing to you, either. Even if our goals are not different now, we'll always be proper rivals, you and me. Ah, uh, no fair. You two are so young and cute. I want to pinch your cheeks. I'm tearing up, and I want to pinch your cheeks. So you're getting a little bit weepy in your old age, eh? <clears throat> what? I'm still young and super energetic. See how Prince will be coming my sister at the lab. What? I've got all the books and data on Pokemon you could ever want. Since you want to be a professor someday... I'll oversee your studies. And I definitely want to. Only, you sure you can? I can be of any help to you? Of course. Mind you, it'll be a lot of work. <laughs> Work's really been piling up since I lost my first assistant. Wait. So, what you really mean is you're offering me the position to help yourself out and clean up after you. Eh, why not? Ah, fine. Still do a bang-up job. 
You'll have my back too, right, Hikaru? And I get his rare league. I want a rare league card. Why don't I have a rare league card? I want a rare league card. Well, well, well now. That certainly was a splendid battle and refreshing back and forth. Uh, what? Well, well, well now. That really touched my heart if I had one. Ah, uh, sword, word, and shield, Bert. With peers. And even Lee. What are you lot doing here? No need for the noise maker, young lady. We have come to meet with young Master Hikaru. Yeah, they didn't get a chance to properly apologize yet. And I'm here to keep an eye on them. They did technically descend from the original kings of Galar, after all. Seems you lot have been up to all sorts of things while I was stuck in Rose Tower trying to take care of the mess the chairman left behind. You have no idea. Those two are forcing Pokemon to Dynamax all over the place. And for that, we are really, truly sorry. Look at our sorriness. We are sorry that you felt that we were wrong in this matter. We are going to do our YouTuber apologies now. We thought only of ourselves and brought harm to innocent Pokemon. We have truly caused a large amount of trouble. Master Hikaru, you helped us even though we did those awful things. You are so worthy of the throne. You could say it's a Dynamax sized amount of worthiness. I already told you, Zacian and Zamazenta are the real royalty. Incorrect! We have abdicated the title to him. There are no other rulers but Hikaru. Hail to the king, baby. <laughs> now that I look closely, you absolutely do have the air of a celebrity. Well, hello, Mr. Fancy Pants. I mean... Well, fancy that. You think you've grown on them, Hikaru? Oh dear, reluctantly, I'm afraid we too must away. Our tour to apologize to those we have troubled awaits. Well then, goodbye. <laughs> hey, don't go running off on your own. Ha! Uh, what? Just so you know, I saw your Pokemon battle against champion Hikaru. You sure have gotten strong. You were so good, I nearly sent out my Charizard without thinking, wanting to join in on the fun. Seems as though you found your own path, your own path to walk in life, Hop. As your older brother, no, as your rival, you have my full support. I, I do. Oh, well, Leon gave you some pretty high praise. Looks like the mouse's got your tongue, you hop. Ah, zip it, Sonia. I do not. <laughs> All right, I guess we should get going, too. Right, then it's a race to see who gets back home first. And there we go. Ah. Well, that is it for Pokemon Shield. Ah. Up next, um, well, that's it for tonight. I mean, literally, that's that's all I have planned for tonight. We've done the we've we finished the game. Next week, um, ugh, on Thursday, I'm going to be playing The Sims. Because I want to take a couple weeks off of Pokemon. When I get back to Pokemon, um, well, it's going to be uh, Legend, Pokemon Legends Arceus. But I'm going to do that in a couple weeks. I'm going to take a couple weeks off, design a new outfit, you know, do a lot of stuff just behind the scenes to get ready for that one. So in two weeks, uh, Pokemon Legends Arceus. And on Sunday, uh, Creature from the Haunted Sea. Finally going to show that one. I think I've already shown it before, but Pumpkin Friend's going to show it, so there's that. 
And yeah, I think that will be it for the night. So, I hope everybody has a great next couple days, and I'll see you on the flip side. Bye. <laughs>